Every day, people miss out on amazing experiences, whether they are passing by a forgotten historical site or driving right on through an abandoned town. I would like to inspire others to take time to appreciate the stories and interesting locations in their areas that are all too often forgotten. On this channel, our mission is to seek out adventure and to find the forgotten and abandoned places that often have stories and urban legends attached to them. Join us as we explore the unknown road. Hello and thanks for watching. There are old churches and schools from the early 1900s on back scattered all across Indiana. Most unfortunately are in various states of disrepair. One such building can be seen along Highway 1 in Jay County, Indiana. Its steeple still reaches proudly into the air, and a stone with the date 1913 is embedded near its base. I have went past this building in Knox Township several times, and after exploring it, I still had no clue what it was. Even a passing cyclist said he could find no info on it. It seems to be a mystery to the residents of Jay County. A search of the names on this stone engraved here on the side of the steeple yielded no information that was usable that involved the church. The interior is pretty well gutted and the roof of the main structure is completely missing. I'm kind of surprised that the steeple is in such good condition when it's missing an entire wall of the main structure. After a lot of searching I came across a web page with information about this derelict building. Oak Grove Schoolhouse is its proper name. Its architecture is far more elaborate than that of most single room schoolhouses of the era. According to a woman named Jennifer Peterson Hybert, who grew up next to it, the Oak Grove School has been abandoned since at least the early 1950s. It's kind of strange that this old schoolhouse had been photographed and posted in many urban exploration or abandoned photography pages, yet no one could find any information about it. Not even a name or the fact that it was a schoolhouse. It's thanks to a Jay County resident named Sandy Cossack that the information is available about this building, as she put a post out and received a response that gave a pretty good summary of what this building is. I hope that this video helps to spread that information and shed some light on this mystery building of Jay County. One final thing that I thought about not even including is the fact that while I was filming, we caught a voice, and there was no one around us other than me and Leslie, and you can clearly hear someone yelling. The farm nearby had no one home at the time. Still not sure what that was, but it's kind of strange. I hope this cool building continues to stand and be photographed for years to come.